KO Art of Sports here with David Mijares fighting February 3rd. Uh, Belasco Theater, man, was about the, the third time around, right there? Third time, third time. Yeah. You, uh, what, t tell, I've been asking all the fighters, tell the people at home what that uh, arena is like. Because there's like, you got people on the balcony, it's called, the, just people are surrounding you. Tell us what it's like to be like in a, fighting in an MSI, intimate atmosphere like that. Being in an atmosphere like that is just, uh, it really is, it, it's almost like being inside your own gym fighting. And it's, it's fun because everyone's there just cheering you on. You feel all the energy, this explosive energy, and you just use it all against to your, be to your benefit. You're fighting a, a fighter from Pennsylvania, not necessarily uh, Philadelphia, right? right but yeah. but they have you know that that style, that reputation. Um, so obviously, I guess you're kind of expecting a, a kind of a brawler, nonstop tough dude. Is that kind of what what you're expecting? Somewhat of he he's uh, he can adapt to both styles. So I'm 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 ready for both. Tell us uh, for fans who haven't seen you. Tell us what your style is like. Kind of how do you fight? Uh, I like to take my time, take my angles step around be more of a technician than anything and uh, but I definitely bring speed and power and uh, you don't want to miss this one you uh, you got the green eyes man do you get a lot of uh, comparison to uh, Shane Mosley no not 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 that not much now, right? but yeah not till now <laughs> uh, you're fighting at a, a super junior welterweight super lightweight um, it's deep division uh, a lot of guys right there what how close do you feel you are to like a, a contendership type spot or, or to eventually kind of uh, bid for a title shot? Uh, I feel like I do have a ways <laughs> because, you know, it's such a stacked division. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I definitely have to work my way up and uh, earn my respect. I want to ask you this uh, this weekend's fights. Uh, obviously, the the weight class below you at uh, at 140, uh, well 135. But uh, Mikey Garcia, man, versus Dijon. Tell us what you thought about that fight and that knockout, and uh, just kind of what you thought of, of his reaction when he was kind of laying on the ground for a long time. Well, since I was switching back and forth between oh, the Golden right. Boy broadcasts <laughs> yeah. and then that, I was only able to see uh, Dejan on the ground, but then I, I saw the whole replay of what happened, and I was very impressed by Mikey's ability to step around and, uh, you know, take that shot when he, when he saw it. So, and uh, it, was, it wasn't against a cupcake. Dejan is a very, very tough fighter. So I was very, very, um, I, was, I was, well, I was excited, but at the same time, I was like, well, wow, it's a serious business. So. Yeah, definitely, man, it's a dangerous spot. Yeah. Uh, tell us as a fan, man, what fight are you looking forward to coming up this year? Uh, let's see. Well, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing I, I don't think there's a particular fight. I, I'm pretty excited to see everyone fight. You know, whenever a fight's you know made, uh, I'm I'm ready to watch it. I'm ready to learn because that's all you can really do is just watch, learn, and try to capitalize on what the these other fighters are doing. Because you know, you look at them. You're, I'm looking up at, up to them, and I'm and I'm seeing what it is that they do and how can I, you know, make myself better, how they're making themselves better, so. I definitely want to ask you just a, a fight in your, kind of around your weight class at welterweight. Um, Keith Thurman versus Danny Garcia, man, how do you see that fight going? How do you see those styles playing out together? I think it's going to be definitely going to be a test for both fighters because they both have explosive power. And, um, but I'm, I'm pretty excited about that fight. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see what happens, definitely. Well, uh, you're 4-0 with three knockouts, man, so we're, uh, we're excited to see you fight as well. You're explosive fighter, man. Thank you so much for the time, man. Can't wait to watch you February 3rd. Thank Appreciate you. it.